So in a nutshell, this experience here at the farm is a perfect example of what Harvest Host is about. Hey everybody, we made it for a pretty short trip. We just pulled in to this amazing farm. So buckle up for a very short, but pretty cool episode. Hey everybody, today we are at a beautiful farm in Lancaster. Pennsylvania, this is Quarryville. Um, it was an impromptu trip. We were not really planning to come here, but we came to, to visit family in the area, so we decided to use our Harvest Host membership, um, find a place to boondock. You see the trailer back there. This is a lavender and alpaca farm. When we arrived yesterday, the, the owner of the farm greeted us with a little mason jar uh, with some lavender like freshly cut oh my god smell amazing they have so many animals here they gave us a little tour what a beautiful beautiful place Dale and Jan the the owners of the farm thank you so much for your hospitality what a wonderful wonderful people who both serve in the military uh, the Navy and the army and wow what a really impressive couple who served this country at a really high level and the stories that they told me were just incredible so Dale, what do you do with the wool from your alpacas and the sheep so we we uh we my wife sorts it all and then we take it down to a mill in virginia and mm -hmm. they process it into roving and into yarn and into other uh, wool projects, products. And they'll blend it all together and stuff into, you know, different yeah. kinds of yarn. How many, about how many cheap and alpacas you have here in your farm? So we have three alpacas and we have, right now we've got about 55 sheep. That's and so we, we the alpaca, or, uh, fin sheep are very um, uh, pr uh, productive. And so we get, we get about three lambs per ewe. So if you breed 10, 10 ewes, you get 30 lambs out of it. So the, the flock gets pretty big in the summertime. Yeah. And then, it, and then we sell, uh, we, we've sold, uh, in the last couple of weeks, we've sold three for breeding. Uh, we're selling another one on Friday for breeding. Uh, so we try to sell the sheep for breeding stock uh, because that's, it, it's, it's the best for the animals and it's also best for, uh, for the price you get on the sheep. So feeling blessed to be here, feeling blessed for people like them to share their home, share their beautiful land so we could come here and enjoy it. So in a nutshell, this experience here at the farm is a perfect example of what Harvest Host is about. It's about building community, it's about going to new places, getting to know local people, ask them questions, mingle, change the scenery, um, enjoy nature, and everything while you travel. There's deer outside. There, there is a mama deer and a baby deer. The baby deer is nursing. Aww. The two little fawn. Aww. Zoom in. More. I can't zoom in more. That's it. Those are the two babies. We are not getting paid to, to say that we love Harvest Host. Actually, back in the days, I didn't like it that much because I, I didn't use it and I didn't know what uh, I was missing out. 
All right, that's it for today. I will see you next week. I think I have a new campground review coming out next week, so um, you don't want to miss it. See you later, guys.